Spring once, while living in the small town of Ashern, my friends Talia Jade and I decided to explore the old abandoned house known as the Trailer Park House at night. The house sat at the edge of town, shrouded in mystery and whispers of haunting spirit. Everyone in Asher knew to stay away from it, but our curiosity got the best of us. As we approached the house, the air grew colder and the moon seemed to hide behind the clouds, casting eerie shadows around us. The creaking of the rusty gates echoed in the still night, sending shivers down our spines. Tell you nervously whispered, are we really doing this? But Jade and I, fueled by a thrill we couldn't resist, urged her to press on. The moment we stepped inside, a chill swept through us, and a sense of dread filled the air. The dim moonlight barely illuminated the dilapidated walls, covered in graffiti and cobwebs. Every creak of the floorboard sounded like a ghostly whisper, and the silence was deafening. As we ventured deeper into the house, strange noises surrounded us, and shadows seemed to move on their own. Talia clutched my arm, her eyes wide with fear, while Jade tried to maintain her composure. Suddenly, a cold breeze brushed past us, extinguishing our flickering flashlights. Panic set in as we fumbled in the darkness, trying to find our way out. Whispers echoed in the halls, an unseen hand seemed to grab at us from the shadows. Talia screamed and Jade called out for help, but there was no one around to hear us. In that moment of pure terror, we realized the rumors were true. The trailer park house was indeed haunted. Our desperate attempts to escape only seemed to lead us further into the grip of the supernatural. It felt like an eternity before we finally stumbled out of the house, hearts pounding and breathless. I am actually getting very bad eerie chills and vibes just talking about it. As we gasped for air outside, safe once again under the moonlight, I couldn't help but feel grateful that Curtis Chasky had declined our invitation to join us. He knew the risks we were facing, risks that I would never forget as long as I lived in the small town of Ashern. The ghostly presence of the trailer park house would haunt me forever, a chilling reminder of the terrifying night we dared to explore its haunted halls. And that's my experience of the trailer park house located in the small town of Ashern. We did come back an hour later to stay the night. Myself and my friends Talia, Jade, let me tell you, I am still scared of going anywhere near there after that traumatic experience.